Here's a quick video on how to update the firmware on Nikon D500 uh, digital SLR camera. This also applies to a lot of other Nikon cameras, uh, but over here I'm just going to use D500 as an example. So first thing first is to check the firmware version of your camera to see if you actually need the update. Uh, to do that, super easy. Basically, you open up the manual and go to custom settings or the setup menu. Uh, over here in setup menu, if you scroll up, it shows the firmware version. Uh, over here, you can see I have the firmware C at 1.11 and I'm not sure what the LD is for, but it's at 2.015. Um, so, okay, confirm. And then the next step is to update the firmware to the newest one, which is 1.14 for firmware C. So we're gonna do we're gonna do that next. So the next step is uh, actually go on to the website to Nikon website and download the firmware for your camera. Uh, over here, you can see I'm at the landing page where it says um, this changes the C firmware to 1.14. It doesn't change the other firmware, so. That's the only thing it's going to update. So choose your operating system, Windows or Mac, and then score down. Uh, you can download right over here by just hitting download. Um, and it will download a file, a uh, .exe file. Okay, so once you have the file downloaded, it'll look like something like this. Um, it's a .exe file, and if you double click, it should create a folder called D500 update and within that it's a binary file which is the actual firmware um, you can see the version is 114 so it is a correct firmware file and the next thing you need is a freshly formatted SD card so I'm gonna put the SD card in and I'm actually gonna directly put this file into my SD card right over here at the root at the root um, folder so next thing close uh, close the card take it out and uh, I'm gonna close the window and we're gonna go back to the camera so this is a card I just uh, put the file in put it right inside <coughs> okay so, I'm turn on the camera. Go to the exact same settings, um, the setup menu and firmware version. Come over here. At your C right now, it have an option to update. That's because you just put the uh, updating firmware in the SD card at the root folder. So if you hit update. Okay, I can't do that because uh, my battery is low. So I'm gonna go grab a fresh pair of battery, and I'm gonna do the update. Okay, I just put the first pair of battery in, so make sure when you do your update, the battery is full. So, go to the menu again, and we're gonna go to firmware version in the setup menu. Hit forward, and this time we're gonna hit update. So they ask you to confirm if I want to update from the old one to the new one. You're gonna select, yes. You have to actually hit the OK button instead of the center button right over there. So, okay, now it's updating. Of course, don't ever turn your camera off during firmware update because that's gonna totally mess up your camera. And on the screen, it's gonna, it's gonna say PC up or PG up. I'm not sure what exactly that means, but it should go pretty smoothly if everything goes well. And it's almost done, so it's about, right now it's about uh, two minutes has passed since the uh, update process started. Alright, so the update is finished, and it says you can turn it off. So I'm going to turn it off and turn it back on. Turning it back on. And let's check the firmware to see if it actually successfully updated, which it is. So, done. 
Uh, there you go, guys. That's how you update Nikon um, camera firmware. For most of their DSRs, it's pretty straightforward. So if you guys have any questions, uh, feel free to ask me in the comment section, and I'll try my best to answer for you guys. And if you find this video helpful, please um, subscribe and like the video. And uh, otherwise, thank you so much, and have a great day.